can't do it because you have to do it by hand because there's no, there's no uh, way to do it. Well, you know what? There's an Excel form that you can download and you can do this. And I did a template for all of them. And it took me probably an hour. So, you know, all of us took our time. You might not think that my time in the work that I do here is, you know, is meaningful, but the time that I take from here to do this is on my personal time. So if I was able to do it, if Scott was able to do his part, I think that we should expect the same from you. Can I speak? Yes. I don't know if you can okay. speak now. Well, I, I, what happened is everyone was given a delegation or a task. Everyone's job has been completed. As treasurer, as president, everything is going to be because on Monday, aside from the hours that I spent more than one hour, more than three hours, doing the reconciliation forms and putting the more together, making sure the receipts are in order, and making sure that the package that vision that is supposed to be submitted is prepared. I took an extra two hours out of my time and went to done on Monday and showed them this stuff. And they said, you know what? Great. And I have an email from Maximo, the auditor who gave us this whole list of stuff that we printed out that somewhere that we took all our notes off of at the budget and finance committee meeting, and they reviewed everything. And you say, you know what, great, mm -hmm. just go have the board sign it. Because what was I missing? The minutes. But minutes have been provided for every month, and I didn't take this down anymore. I didn't have this with me, I had it at home. So big boy, I said, I get a fire from the house, they said, okay. They reviewed the receipts, they reviewed the reconciliation forms, they reviewed the, the paperwork, the assignments, everything had their task. And the auditor, as of Monday, was pleased with it. Now, the question I have, and I'm not saying I'm being stubborn about it, but the tiki tack stuff about saying, scan it. Well, that's the same position I'm talking about. What that scanning does is it makes a physical document into digital format. So listen, once you get this package, the same email she sent to me, the same email she sent to you, you include that one page, ding, Connie's email, into the digital package, ding, and guess what? The package is complete. We don't need to wait no deadline. This is ridiculous to say we have to wait till Monday at 6 o'clock. It's done right now. For you to sit there and say, you know what? I cannot forward my attachment to this email. It's already digitized anyways. That's what this whole package is going to be. It's going to become digitized so it become a package, right? So you just email it to everybody. So the very same email that we're discussing, which is an Office Depot receipt and a Norton antivirus receipt that's sent to Connie, your email is the attachment. You can PDF that right. and submit so, it right. you scan but all since it's things. already there in your laptop or at home or whatever computer you have and all these papers are scanned, if we hand them to you, you say this piece of paper goes inside the package and everything goes to the board. It's very, very simple. Thank you, Mr. And Mr. everything's Mr. already Mr. been Mr. Mr. Thank you. So, your question, so, your question, so, so you, you want Connie so, to do your job? No. She doesn't oh, have to do no. my job. Oh, okay. My job's complete. Okay, then oh. we'll go with the so, package you submit right. and we'll just submit it to Dennis. Uh, Garcia. Yes, this um, I I hear what Anthony's saying about very simple. If it's very simple, I don't understand why we can't have a hard copy. Uh, I understand you submit digitally, but I think it's it's we need to the neighborhood council needs to keep track of hard copies. We need to have hard copies. I mean, it has to right here. no because you're Anthony. missing you're missing the receipts. That's why it's not complete. So it's, not uh, it's my it's turn not to not talk. Not I'm sorry, but. You know, if there is, if you get PRA, you, it would be beneficial. It would be beneficial to have a complete hard copy packet. I understand that. Okay. My second concern is um, Scott Johnson is suggesting for the packet to be complete at least 48 hours before the meeting. My suggestion would be that the packet be ready when the agenda is posted, and to have that ready, give us plenty of time to Absolutely. review because 48 hours maybe for some might be enough time but for others it's not enough time we need to have it ahead of time to review it before the meeting. and those documents so, so that those good documents good that Tony sent were sent to a specific group of people that were not sent to the yeah. entire board that were not sent to the stakeholders and whatever you have in your hand I don't even know what it looks like because I haven't seen it it's not digitized yet it's not complete and it's not you know ready to be put into a document for review. So you've seen this, correct? Has anybody seen this, right? Did you open your email? You must have seen this. Scott Johnson, you've seen this? Mm -hmm. Tammy, right? Yes. Okay. What this does is it came, obviously, if you've seen your email, it came as an attachment. It came from Easy Up as an invoice receipt, like we're just speaking about, Yolanda. The other two that you're saying is a receipt, it is not a receipt. 
So don't start saying, Anthony, you're missing two receipts, or Scott or Tammy, your package is not complete, you're missing two receipts. It's an email that was sent in verification from Norton Antivirus, and the other one from Office Depot, not as an attachment, straight to Connie as an email. That email will now work as a receipt, as if it was, theoretically. Why? Right? Because we made these transactions on the internet. The point I'm saying is, as any person who, like Ruben, who doesn't have internet, and you make a purchase, I think it's responsible for that person to say, you know what, here's the receipt that I bought from Office Depot for $356, and what I did is I put it on here because I did my homework too, and you can see all of these reconciliations forms, so obviously on the last page it'll be on there. Office Depot supplies, 648 bucks. So I did my work. But I it's thought, all complete. I thought the whole all purpose of, the of emailing the receipts the right. was so that okay. it would be complete so today. Now okay. the whole idea so is now that all you got to do is get that. Look, receipt here's what we're going to do. And it's done. It's just okay. an email. If so if you want to excuse my no, I can go to the next room, give me permission, I'll get on the internet. If you don't want to do it here or Scott, then do it. You print a piece of paper that will make everyone so thrilled and excited about that I walk in with two pieces of paper. Can you go to bring it up? Of course. Okay, go. But that's what I'm saying. You guys make life so complicated. Like, oh, I have to do He didn't do it. He failed. Just go do it. Stop acting. Stop talking. Go do right, it. Right, it's been done. Okay. Uh, okay, wait. Okay, wait. So, uh, so uh, now so everybody knows what I'm going to go do is you're... print emails okay. that belong to you. Yes, thank you. Thank they belong you. to the board, not to me. Right. Okay. Right. okay. Uh, okay. I'm going to go do some extra work. I'm going to go do some extra work. Excuse me. Okay. What I'm going to recommend is get this on the agenda. I want it's to on the agenda. I have already done something. Let's stand. The folks that have this is on the agenda to approve the packet, complete packet, okay, under the treasurer's report. That the complete packet reconciling all our outstanding issues be as a whole taken care of, and I'll go from there. I, my my point is now I, I'm I'm done going back and forth. I want to see a result. I, I want agree. To stay. I think what we have to do here, Connie, is we got to, we, if we did an audit on the time we spend going back and forth on this issue, okay? And I mean, I have to be a point blank here. Um, I, I'm being, I'm trying to be objective here as much as possible. Sometimes, you know, when the filibuster is going on down the road over here, you know, it's kind of hard. But, you know, I'm falling into that trap right now. But, you know, I just opened up my bylaws and I'm looking at our respective duties. And, if we're consistent in all following our respective duties as outlined by the bylaws, then we should not be having these discussions. And if we have time and somebody needs help, you know, we should be in good faith helping one another. But really, I, I totally agree with you, Scott. So let's get, this on, that, look, let's get this on the agenda. Let's get this on the agenda. Let the committee as a whole be the final judge. Thank you. And I, I agree with you. And I no one can say that I was the one that did the first, the last two years of financial statements with Pam Marcus. Mr. Monsanto was not involved in that process so I know how long it takes I've done it before what I'm saying is when I did that I submitted an entire complete packet to the executive committee prior to submitting it to the board as it should be done as is required by that this piece by piece is not a complete packet Scott I'm sorry but I have a question if that's if it's true that he said that he did go to done on Monday why didn't he scan it there I, that, that, that would have solved I, Look, if they I, approved it then. We met at last week. You were there, Scott. We mm -hmm. all worked together to try to get it done. He promised a complete packet by, by Sunday. Mm -hmm. By Sunday, that's right. So we're way past Sunday. <laughs> so I mean, I'm, and I'm not trying to judge out that I know we're all busy. I mean, my responsibility is getting the agenda, making sure we have the attachments, scanning the stuff, getting all our records, getting the online every day, making sure the online stuff is accurate. I mean, it takes a lot of my time, and yet I do it. Those two emails that he's talking about, they have been sent to him? Yes. They were sent to all the board committee members on Friday. So I mean, if he needed help printing them, he yeah, could have asked. Yeah, he could have emailed me at that point and said, could you please print them? I would have gladly printed them for him for today. If people have their hands up. Yes, I'm sorry, Cynthia. In the question of scanning, was he supposed to scan everything and send it to you in a He was able to scan it to all the executive committee and all the stakeholders by Sunday. Yes. So what he's handing you for you to scan it, that wasn't part of the agreement. He was supposed to do it already. Since Sunday. He and agreed to it. Okay, and in regards to those two receipts that are missing. They were submitted to him on last Friday, a week ago. The electronic version. The electronic. And he never said it. He would have, if, I would have gladly printed them for him, Cynthia. 
he would have said today, can you please print them out for the executive committee meeting? I print everything out. Why wouldn't I print those two receipts? But he never got back to me. None of the committee members, everybody got a copy of it from the executive and from the budget and finance committee. But he did get the last two that we needed. Yes, I sent it to him a week okay. ago. That's what I'm saying. He knows what I'm talking about, and he should have done it. And if I'm not mistaken, <coughs> Sunday was the last day to submit an entire yes. packet so that all of you guys would have this packet in your today. hands today. You were that meeting, remember? You recall? Yeah, I'm. I'm yeah. Uh, Samo? Yeah, you were there with yeah. Sunday. That's Samo? Is yes, that what yeah. we agreed upon? Yeah. So we're not making any. No, no, no. Yeah, I, I mean, my, my whole deal is. <coughs> We need to move forward. I told you know, you. defeating the purpose and, and, and whatnot. And maybe our brother is just overwhelmed. We don't know. Everybody has their personal deals going on. And just this little minimal thing, it's not just affecting us, it's going to affect this the whole budget and the outreach that we have to do, right? So, I'll, anyway, the question that I had was okay, he's making the hard copies, right? So, are we still going to initiate and send your, your emails and put it in that digital packet? That way they have both, we have a digital complete packet as well as this hard copy. The hard copy has to be signed once it's approved and then it has to be scanned. Okay. So until that happens, it's a draft. So oh. we have to make sure it's just a draft. Oh, okay, so. Official document. No, I understand. So eventually it's all going to be a digital. I just want to know if there's going to be a hard copy and a complete copy. There should be a draft copy. digital copy submitted so to everyone. All, all, all the documents will say that until they approve it. Yeah, yeah. So all of the board members need to take a look at it. If they have any questions, then at the point of the general board meeting, they can have questions on any of the expenses, on anything that is missing, or anything that mm -hmm. doesn't look like they, they understand what is happening. So that is why it's a draft. Once everyone is fine with it, they sign it then up. you know we vote on it. He and I have to sign the forms, and then it gets digitized. Sent to done, and then you know the all of those copy. all of those items need to be also available for the, the, the stakeholders at the general board meeting, so that they can see the draft as well in hard copy. No, no, no. I, I totally understand. Okay. What and was. the essence of this is to make sure that each dollar that we spend, that is a public dollar, it's not our money, is transparent, and yeah, we are accountable. Yeah, of course. Of course. It's so, with any, any budget and finance. Uh, yeah, I just hopefully we get this stuff we will. so we can do this we job. We will. We just need a complete packet draft at this point. When I did my uh, statement that was made a moment ago, is that the equal word that was used or something to that doesn't apply here whatsoever. Nobody's Thank equal you. here is involved in this thing. Oh, <laughs> no one's equal is involved here mm -hmm. whatsoever. Okay, statement was made short a moment ago, just before you left. Here's a confirmation number. Uh, Thank you, Mr. Mm -hmm. uh, that uh, we should put our egos away and all that. Ego has no room here. No one's been on the ego. That's just picking on the side that wants this thing. In other words, I feel they're covering up for you when they shouldn't. You don't need anybody to cover you. You do very well on your own. Exactly. Okay, and to abuse that word, I really find that out of order and out of place. And unprofessional for the person that just uttered that. Okay, what we have here obviously is favor of communication, mainly on your part, Anthony. Okay, when you were out, several people had their hands up. President and vice president took the time and explained everything that they have, that they have explained to you and that you're already aware of. We weren't, so they explained it to us. Okay, but you're not being here as a team leader. While you were done and presenting that, I commend you and salute you for going out of your way and doing that. Because you want this monkey off your back as much as everybody else does. Course, okay? But what you didn't do it, I have the word, I expect you to respect that when everybody talks, don't answer them back. Just wait. Okay? Uh, <clears throat> that's why I was being out of order, trying to get you to stay in order. Anyway, uh, while you were done, you had a beautiful opportunity there while you showed everything you had to them, they reviewed it, and they agreed with it. What you need to do is have all of that done here and go through the process of what this neighborhood council administrative section, which you are the executive officers, what they're asking of you. They even gave you time extra to do this and do that. Okay, you should play ball, humor them. Even if it doesn't agree with you, they voted on those issues. And you should have 
Grab all that junk and shove it down their throat. Take, get it up your <laughs> back. Just give it to them. They've been telling you left and right how to do it. They've explained everything. Why you, you're not being a team leader? Just give it to them the way they want it. You're correct in a lot of things you said. It's true. But you're not, it's your way or the highway. <clears throat> they're going collectively what they're asking of you. No one single person is picking on you. They've already voted on these issues as your executive. That you are. So you should just play, play the game. Go with the flow. You're right on a lot of things you say, but it's your way or the highway because you've done this, you've done that, you've done this, and it's all right there. But you didn't hand them the packet that they want from you. That's what they want, a packet. And that's what you should have gave them. Even if you don't agree with them, make the packet up the way they want it and shove it down their throat. And that gets Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Chavez. Thank you. Okay, let's, let's move on with this. It's going to be on the agenda. Let me go ahead and raise the motion. Okay, okay I'll second it. Oh, I just don't want to finish up. Maybe you guys feel like I heard Mr. Ruben Chavez express to me several times, even out in public, I don't mind the... the uh, constructive. Constructive, I guess, but the straightforwardness, or the candidness. But the truth of the matter is, as you'll see on these emails, or these that have hard stock papers, not paper, 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 they come from Connie Castro. So for me, it's, a, it's kind of difficult for someone to say, I emailed it to you, and now it's your fault for not printing it. Now, I never received this until you just sent it to me. Never, ever, ever did I receive this. So these are purchases that were based on the neighbor's council that the president was responsible for. She had the card, she used it over the internet, maybe by phone or something. Excuse me, it was, it was sent to you on June 12, 2013, the original copy. I always send you copies of everything. If you didn't see your email, that's a different thing. It's right yeah. here. Okay, that's fine. If it's on there. Yeah, I'm just telling you, I did not submit it to you. It's these things. Uh, it's that, yeah, let's go to Anthony. Anthony. Seriously? So Seriously, let's not even go there. So okay, for some so people to say that they you. don't want to put this on the agenda for something that they already have, it's been on the internet. Okay, that thank you, Mr. Masano. So the whole package was complete. You will, right? okay. So now when listen, everyone loves to delegate problems. Now listen, I'm not going to scan this. That's not my job. Okay. Someone else can scan it. You have the full package and present it to the board because my job as the... Whose job is it to scan it? Listen. My job as the chair of the Budget and Finance Committee is to give everything to you in writing. And I even submitted my motions in writing. Okay? Right. So, you have your so now that we have the whole package, someone will sit down and do more work and scan them and do everything that, like you say, that your wish and your vision and your whatever you wish to occur transpire. But I've completed and fulfilled the obligation of the committee level, which is to prepare it. Organize it and submit it. It's prepared, organized, and submitted. It's all right there. Okay, then it's I guess you right give there. it to our secretary. You see, that, that's the whole, that's what I guess. Everybody says do this, yeah. do, do this, do this. I'm doing five jobs. You. I'm doing five I'm jobs. Complete your process. The president is asking you. Give it to the secretary. Give it to the secretary. Give it to the secretary. Yes, I can only talk it. Can you do my closing to do it? Yes. Because if you ask me for help or whatever, I do both things for me. And they can't make it. They can't make it. I need help. Yes, I want both. We all need help. Is there any one? Okay, so Mr. Secretary, could you please review it to make sure it's complete? These are the minutes. If it is complete, then I. Secretary or? Secretary. Scott? No. Scott, the one. Of course, but. Well, Secretary, the one. He's documented on the minutes. He's in charge of recording, Secretary. Making sure that it's a recorded, complete document. After it's been scanned. So well, right. there's no point to be scanned if it's incomplete. It's not incomplete. We just gone over everything from one through four. I, I, you know, I really can't say that it's incomplete because Andy, I haven't read it. Scan it. So scan it. Send it to them. I know. Just scan it. Mr. Okay, so let's do officially. Mr. Secretary, can you um, check to make sure it's a complete package for our minutes and documents? If it is complete, then we'll go ahead and scan it. How do you know it's complete? This I don't know. How do you know it's complete? I need a reference list. That's the problem. And how, then you can't take it off the agenda. That's what I'm saying. Nobody knows. And you're saying, I won't put it on the agenda. You can't do that. Well, if the treasurer doesn't know, then how is it? I don't know. I thought that I confirmed on Monday. The president okay, so the I'm going to have Mr. Secretary document it on the record that yes, Mr. It is. Treasurer is, that uh, Anthony Montano is stating that it is a complete document. He will report it. And based on his okay. determination, Mr. No, done. No, 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 no. Mr. Uh, Scott Johnson can determine whether it's a complete packet or not. And then 
made a reference list of problems to check. All right, get to that point, right now, get to where they're at. Everyone's everyone's had, listen, everyone's had <clears> the same <throat> email that Asana sent and Maximo sent and Kanye sent and Tammy sent it to Kanye and Kanye sent it to us right in front of the library, like, oh, you got it, you got it by email. That's the new thing in this digital age. Send it to me by email. So the answer is, Scott, to get wow. to your answer is Okay, so let's just move on. So we're going to talk about it. Get it over with. That's you know, it. I, 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 I want to cross reference it. something, you cross reference it with okay, the email. Okay, and then once it's done, I would like the corresponding secretary to scan it. I'm not going to scan it. You see? It's <laughs> not my job. That's what I used to get. I'm not going to scan it. I'm not going to scan it. Suggestion you made Monday. It's, I'm gonna, it's a suggestion. Let me get no, no motion there. Well, the suggestion is really Monday because hours. you know really really looks to be 72 hours. Okay, if I go with that. <laughs> okay, <laughs> but have a when I mean, you do this, Anthony, with your packet, have a reference list on, on the venture cover page. Okay, and then and then set everything there. We got the minutes there. The minutes were like minutes for us. Okay, because that was a primary big thing. Right. From, from the last budget meeting, with minutes, you need minutes to document. Tony needs to sign. I've already signed my, my part. Okay. So then, once you bring it, so, I will. I will go. I will meet with you, and I will gather them from you, and I will scan them. But it has to be scanned. They're all right there. And Mr. Mr. Cosentino, will you print them? Oh yes, yeah, yeah, print them. That is his job. He's the printer. Okay. Community. So we're working together here. Is yeah, that because uh, you know, realistically, I'm going to make a valid point here, okay? And I think a lot of, I, you know, the good benefit to, on here, you know, I, I'm noticing here that I think Mr. McDonald's had quite a frustration he's kind of getting whipped on for the last few weeks. Sometimes, sometimes you have to have a stick approach, but I think right now we're so close to the end, I want to thank you with care, okay? And say, so, hey, look, you package there. Back in the stair, we think we wasted close to 30 minutes. Yeah, let's get moving on this. Let's get this on the agenda. It's on the agenda. Okay? It should be agenda. It's Wednesday. Correct. We got tomorrow, I'm here because my Rob will be busy calling Friday. Give me a holler. I may have to be out of town Saturday, Sunday real quick. But if we need something, and we maybe if we can get a place, because really what handicaps a lot of this too is that Right now, we would not be happy to schedule. if we had an office, realistically, no, I, but we because don't. we would be able to sit in an office when we were off, off these meeting times and be able to do this stuff, because I know I put out $10 today on copies, okay? And I put 40 in each. And, uh, and then he, he goes down and goes to City Hall, so I mean, it is getting done. But I'm sorry. Okay, let's just move forward. Get it on the agenda, so on the Treasury Report packet. Good. And, and, and the treasurer is responsible for having the packet read and giving at least a reasonable time for review by the full board. Okay, and then you can contact me and uh, we'll go ahead and get it scanned. Mm -hmm. By before Monday at 6. Is it going to be scanned? Or Sunday? Is it going to be scanned? Sunday, I'm sorry, Sunday at 6. 72 hours. So that the stakeholders can have. Well, why don't, Anthony, why don't we do this on Sunday? And this should be, I think, agreeable. You, Tan, you Connie, and I, we meet at the restaurant. Sit down at the table. Okay. I, I, I can't Sunday because Sunday is not a good day for me. It's my busiest day of the week. Okay. I will scan it once I you guys review it and then I can take it with me and then I can go home at night and scan it. Yeah. Okay. Review it, guys. Is that fair? Review is it. That right. fair? Anthony, you know what? Technology is like scanning. It's like now loading into a Xerox train. Right. Yeah. Right. See, I have the front right. desk. Right. Big the deal. Scan. Even I can do that. So, oh, but I just, I just can't scan it. What order? It, like what goes first? What goes second? Yeah, gotta have, gotta have a cover page on top. Maybe, maybe take your copy and take one of your copies. And have a page number on the bottom. Have it if you want. Yeah. To. And hey, right, hey, right now, like, I mean, it's just like reading Scott, a book, okay. a table of contents. If, if the packet is ready, as Mr. Manzana is indicated, can you guys meet up on Friday so that, you know, perhaps you can do it and, and review whatever it is that needs to be reviewed? Then, um, Mr. Santillan will have time to make copies for the stable. Yeah, we need our hard copies. We need this All of that needs to be done, you know, and it's going to be a lot of materials because remember, this is a huge packet. Unless, unless we just um, send it via electronically through 
the Yahoo, the website, make sure and, and not print so much. We don't know. Take the call, Anthony. Do your call, Anthony. How do you want to do it? Take the call electronically. I'm going to take the workload and I'll go scan it and I'll make everyone please do it. I'll go scan it. You okay, don't well, have then, to I'm done because I told you. Then we scan it. So it's in order. Everything's like this all paid for. Here's all the money. So then, Mr. Your phone's going to cut his line after you take ownership, but that's not my problem. That's what I'm saying. Okay. It's not ownership. So remember, mean, the obligation of the committee is done. Well, can you guys discuss this? Submitted to the executive committee. Okay, let's do this. Now let's it's up to this. us to say who's going to do it and where. And everyone loves to just say, I will, go call Anthony. Anthony, thank you. Let him do it. Anthony, thank you. Thank you. Ah, ah. Um, I am committed to scanning so, it by 4 p.m. Sunday, so it'll be on the agenda by the post-date. So it's up to you guys to meet after the meeting and discuss the details. We still have to do something? I don't have to do anything. I already showed this to the auditor. I'm happy that Max I'll show you guys an email from Max right here. It's still got a packet. He, That's not a packet. He's, he's, the packet. Paper. Those are just papers, loose papers of what they requested. Exactly. That's, That's not, not a package. package. What's the not difference? Scan it. Scan it. Get it over. She says she's going to send a proposal. You said a proposal. Just, here, here's a proposal. Well, what is it? Different people. Well, we yeah, get a package. Is it like your packet you get on the history of Rose Hill? <clears throat> you got so the very beautiful packet? It starts Same with thing, and it's, a, and it's a smaller, smaller version. If, if they find something incomplete or issues with it, that's going to be a problem on you. Okay. Okay. But I think you have a point. Scott, can you discuss this with Anthony after the meeting? Thank you. The details you the, are now up to you guys. Okay, let's move forward. Thank you so much. My um, it's so, a little, so we're we're gonna, we, we, wait, 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 wait. Before we move forward, we have not taken a formal vote on what's going to be yeah, on the agenda. I wanted to read the motion. Motion yeah. to approve the Alley 32 MC budget package as required by the Empower the no by Empower Alley. I can remove the by Empower Alley to one free spot attachment D. Yeah, it's going to be attachment D. Attachment C. 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 Actually, I have attachment A as strategic outreach plan. Mm -hmm. I should outreach survey attachment B. Budget packet should be seen. It stays on the agenda. Mm, you're right. It should be seen. Right. Okay. You got a second on the motion? I'll second it. So, county first, I second. All in favor? Second to five. Raise your hands. Opposed? Abstention. 302. Change mine to no. Change yours to. <coughs> You're abstaining still, or are you changing both? No. 311. 311? Okay. Okay, committees. Anthony, my horror page of tender resignation a long time ago. For which one? 
education. We had talked about that a few months back. Got That's right. Right. And I think, or did he, did he, did Michael say he was resigning I from the committee he was. or resigning as chair? I mean, from the arts and culture. Arts and culture, no. I think it was the education, but I haven't received any. No, I know he resigned for education, but was he resigning also from the arts and culture? No. Or just as chair? Just, just as chair. Just as chair. So the, there's still some pending ones. That's why some board members haven't gotten back to me. Um, I know, Cynthia. Since you're on, on like four committees, is it four, one, three, three committees, is there any two you would like to stay on just so that we give the opportunity to buy Anselmo, Yoli, Capricia, and... Um, the new board member. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I can go ahead and remove myself from membership and outreach, and if I need to volunteer, I can volunteer. Okay. I volunteer for that. that I'm sure have it's needed. Well, here's the issue we were going to talk about it tonight, and, and what do you guys think? I know a lot of the committees haven't had quorum because, um, for whatever reason, you know, I know we're all volunteers. I know you haven't had quorum for your last two meetings, Eddie. Well, the same people that show up. That's what I'm saying. So, um, one of the suggestions from the city attorney was to, uh, for our bylaws to and the way you had it before, Anthony, was three, three committee members, which was made up of one, two stakeholders, and two, two board members, one stakeholder. So that, that's another option if we want to go that route, since so many, you know, we can condense the committees. That's something you guys can all bring it up open for discussion. I think you should put it on the agenda so that we can vote for three, to, to go back to the old system of three committee yeah. members. Yeah, anybody second two, 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 you know, two board members and one stakeholder. And then if anybody else, you know, wants to show up, they can always volunteer. That's true. Um, the only, only, only we haven't the motion. Does anybody second the motion? Well, uh, second for the discussion. Okay. Uh, okay. My thought is here is you have a new influx of committee members. Okay. Um, so first, we should give those two committee members a chance to fill the vacancies. Mm -hmm. The other thing you have tier two is, is that some committees now are, are in the middle of projects that they've been talking about and to disrupt the, the makeup of the committee 